What did the partners of 90 Day Fiancé were up to during the live broadcast? When Usman asked for the phone number of a pretty girl from Hausa, Kimberly saw it before anyone else did. Oddly enough, even after that, Kimberly believed they were soulmates. Because of that, I would call her delusional. This week, Kimberly Menzies gave an interview. First, she stressed that her romance with Usman Soja boy Umar is an honest relationship. She revealed that she took an entire trip to Nigeria outside of filming. That's when they got to know each other. He's just really funny. Like, I don't think people understand what a good sense of humor he has, Kimberly praised. We have so much in common. I know it sounds crazy as hell, but we like the same TV shows, we like the same food. I really felt like I met my soulmate, you know? In my whole 52 years of living, I've never felt so comfortable with another human being, she expressed. He just likes it when I'm Dark Circle Kim with my hair pulled back, you know? And I just feel like seeing him and knowing where he came from. Kimberly said she recognized the real him, just made me love him that much more. Like, we went and fed the poor and the homeless when I went on my private trip. That's why I always wanted somebody that is just as giving and as kind-hearted as I am. She's given him a lot of gifts, and she's also the one who makes all these trips. And most importantly, she's okay with him having a second wife. But Kimberly's sober about what she's getting herself into. I want to make that clear, I would never make another woman feel like the handmaid's tale, okay? Kimberly insisted. It's not like that. I would totally be in the child's life, totally. Even if it's just, you know, my Christmas year or whatever. Kimberly continued awkwardly. I am not raising it, but I mean, I would be more supportive than how I've been in the past. I love Usman enough to let this happen. I have learned that I have to pick my battles. She explained, I kind of stepped to the side when it comes to the subject a little bit, but we've talked and we have clarity on how it's gonna be. We have a plan that's for us. I can't really say it right now, so it's difficult. It's something that I never thought I would imagine, but I think that just like if he ever comes here, he's gonna have to adapt to my culture, she suggested. Kimberly talked about how Usman has given her a lot of self-esteem because many people on social media troll her as an ugly and desperate woman. Kimberly then expressed, I mean, that disgraces me more and my self-worth than anything Usman has done so far. I block all damn day, but like, my self-worth is really important to me right now at this moment. At 52 I am beautiful, I look amazing, I probably look the best I've ever looked, right? And Usman gives me that too. And she said she called Usman names for his insult about having beautiful girls on his call. Kimberly's only regret is that she wishes she had spilled the milkshake on him. Thanks for tuning in, subscribe not to miss anything.